Carol Cosgrove is the next door neighbor to 48 Back Road in Danville, New Hampshire. She said Thursday afternoon she heard multiple gunshots. Six or seven in a row. Boom, 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 boom. It's like, okay, what the heck's going on? Carol and other neighbors didn't think anything of it because people often hunt and do target practice in the area. However, around 10.30 last night, Danville police found a woman shot to death inside the house. We don't have any idea uh, what the number or the extent or the nature of the wounds are uh, that this poor woman suffered. It's horrible. It's horrible. We don't even know how old she is or anything. It's just horrible to think it's that close. The 911 call came from inside the home. Officials say other people were there besides the woman, but no arrests have been made. There's no individual that's in custody at this time. Definitely not. The, the police just told us that we're okay. I was like, okay, I don't think so, but okay. I have kids. So that's what questions me, because we moved out here to be, be safer and quieter. This spreading concern throughout the community. Oh, this is shocking. Like, this is a big for the community because things like this, we, we don't happen around here. The chief medical examiner started an autopsy on the woman earlier today at 11 p.m. And officials tell us that they expect that autopsy to be done sometime this evening. As for the identity of the woman, officials say they're not going to release that until the family has been notified of this news. We're live here in Danville, Troy Lynch, WMUR News 9.